Yo, what is up guys? Jacob here, aka Jacob Juice, and today we're back with another Flippity Floppity video. And today, I am doing a new thing. This might be a new series, and this may just be a one thing, or one time thing, depending on whether or not it does kind of good. Um, obviously none of my videos do good, but if it does a little bit better than the average. So basically what I'm doing, you might be confused by the title. Um, basically what I'm doing is I will go to Google Earth on my phone, click on the I'm feeling lucky thing, and then it if you don't know what that is, it takes you to a random place on the earth. And I will see either what town that is in, if it's a small country, then I'll just do the country. But basically, I just want to learn random towns. And at some point, I kind of want to fill, like, half or maybe a whole notebook of just random towns countries places and basically just like do research on them like do the population when it was built i guess or whatever and just stuff like that it it, it sounds kind of confusing but i've done it before with a couple things it wasn't the same thing i don't know but like you'd be surprised on how much information there is on like these teeny tiny places like i did like this teeny tiny place it had like probably like 20 houses in total and it was surprisingly it had like a lot of history like why people moved there like way back in like the 1800s and stuff it was it was actually really really fun because you get to learn like the origins of a bunch of places um okay so yeah i guess that i'm gonna Go ahead into it. Okay, so as you saw by that time lapse and probably me talking in the background, um, I have written everything down. Sorry about that lighting. Um, sorry about my handwriting too, it's not very good. Okay, so I'm just basically gonna read through everything that I wrote. I'm probably gonna use the same format for everything. It's basically the wiki, I guess, definition, kind of, like the, the wiki person explaining it. And sometimes I'll have to summarize it. It's just this one was only one sentence, which was kind of weird. But basically it said, it's called La Conception, I guess. La Conception is a village and municipality in the War Warren Tides region of Quebec, Canada. Part of the Le Warren Tides regional country municipality. I have no idea how to pronounce most of this. Most of these videos are probably, I'm probably gonna have a terrible time pronouncing. But, um, okay, so that was just that. Sometimes it'll be two cent, or sometimes it'll be like one sentence, sometimes it'll be a few sentences. I'm probably gonna do three or four sentences, the max each, um, thing. Cause I don't wanna have run out of room for this and then have like one little thing on the other page. That'd be kind of a waste of a page. And so yeah, next I did, I'm probably, I might do more or less from some of the things if it doesn't have it in the wiki. If I'm most, I'm going to get most of the stuff from the wiki. And then after I do most of the stuff from the wiki, then I will just look up the name of the place and then kind of see from there. Like these, all three of these bottom things are from... Not from the wiki, from different things. Okay, 
So basically, I'm just going to do the date that he was created, the mayor slash just leader in general, the area, like how much space it takes up, and the population. And, okay, so it was created January 1st, 1882. So that was like so like long ago and it it sounds like so long ago but if you think about it a lot of the places that are here today were made like way back then and stuff sometimes earlier like a lot of the places these days were probably made in either the late 1800s or early 1900s okay and the mayor is it's so weird i feel like i've seen the this last name it's called or his name is Maurice Plouf. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if that's a boy or a girl. I have no idea. But his slasher's name is Maurice Plouf. It's spelled M-A-U-R-I-C-E space P-L-O-U-F-F-E. So I don't know why, but I've seen Plouf before. And then the area, it's 140.5 kilometer squared or 54.25 square miles so i don't know if that's big or small I, I guess that we'll see whenever we create some other ones um population i have no idea if this is a lot either i kind of live in a small town and i think that my population i completely forgot i think it's somewhere around like 700 or 800 or 1300. It's one of those three numbers. It's either 700, 800, or 1300. I don't know why. It's just those three numbers kind of stuck in my head. The bottom three, I don't know if I'll keep it as three because three is kind of a good number for this. But this is basically going to be three facts about the place. Or not, not, not really three facts. Definitely not three facts. More like opinions. Like three of my thoughts on this place. So my first thought, whenever I looked this place up, I saw a, not a bunch, but like about like five or 10 things that said like, oh, La Conception, um, tourist or t tourist guide or trip advisor, hotels and stuff. I think that comes up for every place, but you know, it had like a bunch of stuff for like tourist place. So I think that this is a big tourist place. Um, second thing the town is right around a river and actually like i think 47 miles of it square miles is land and then the other whatever number it is is water because i i think that i saw that on the wiki how or wiki how i keep almost saying wiki how in this video wiki article <laughs> i saw that in the wiki article and then the third thing it's very hilly, if that makes any sense. Not not the clothing brand, but it's like, I, I was going to say mountainous, but I don't think it's really like difference in, you know, height and stuff for land that much. Like if, if you, you couldn't have seen that, but whenever I look at the Google Earth and then I kind of like, instead of making it 2D, I made it 3D, and then I looked sideways, and it was, like, huge hills, um, usually along the river, it was, it's hard to explain, you know, like, like, you see, you, you know what you saw, but then you kind of forget. Okay, guys, that's gonna be the end of the video, hope you guys like it, make sure you smash that like button down below, hit it with a truck, hit it with a car, just give it a little tappy tap, um, let's see if we can get to 80 subscribers by the end of the month. I know that we can do it. Probably can't. By the way, guys, I'm going to be having a lot of Supreme and that type of videos soon because my brother has, like, 20 things coming in the mail for the Supreme. Not actually 20, like, 5. But, um, I'm also getting a new microphone, so, um, quality of video is definitely going to be increasing the next week or two i guess probably like one week it's gonna arrive on july 25th and i'm probably gonna upload this july 17th or 18th i'm not really too sure but um yeah
Peace.